Alexa, let's play Teen Jeopardy. This Just finished uh, Sports Teen Jeopardy. It went 11 out of 12. Pretty good. Thanks, Johnny, and welcome, players. Now it's time for the clues this week. Let's hear them. I'm ready. I am ready. Starting off with, what can are you to me? Senator Ted Kennedy, was this relative to Robert F. Kennedy Jr.? But his brother. Nope. The correct response was, what is uncle? A little bit. At first, Jane Austen's heroine Elizabeth doesn't like this man's attitude, but in the end they're united. Who is Darcy? That's correct. Food. This type of beef, a popular St. Patrick's Day dish often served with cabbage, has a name that means it's been preserved by salting. What is corned beef? Great. Oscar Youth. Before getting an Oscar nomination, this actress won hearts as Queen Amidala. Who is Portman? Excellent. The Summer Olympics. The 1972 Olympics hosted by this German city were the scene of terrorism and tragedy. What is Munich? That's right. Teen Queens. At 15, Lady Jane Grey was imprisoned in this fortress when accused of treason by Mary Tudor. What is the Tower of London? That's right. D in math. The response starts with the letter D. It's the term for the line that cuts a square into two triangles. What is a diagonal? Great. So easy. Awards. This playwright won a Pulitzer Prize for Death of a Salesman. Who is, uh, I don't know. Can't that is incorrect. It. The it's correct response was, who is Arthur Miller? Yeah, Miller. Potpourri. Since 1910, the border of the covers of National Geographic magazine has been this color. What is yellow? That's right. The world of sports, also called kegling, this sport dating back to ancient Egypt can keep you in the gutter. Was bowling. That's correct. This fall in entertainment, while E is the first name and middle initial of this cartoon character who plummets off cliffs pursuing a bird. Who is Wile E. Coyote. Correct. The last one is. Old Testament heroes. When this man came to present the Israelites with the tablets of the law, they were dancing around a golden calf. Who is Moses? Yes, that's it. Let's see how you did. Good work. You scored 10 correct this week. You scored in the top 1% of players. Thanks for playing today. Yeah, both of those misses, it seems like both of those misses were easy. Easy. I knew, I obviously I'm familiar with Death of a Salesman, I'm not a big fan, but I know, and yeah, Arthur Miller, like, he's a super famous playwright, I knew that, and it was in my head, I just, I don't know, I just couldn't get it out. Uh, I can't really think of the first one that I missed, but it seems like that was maybe a little bit tougher, but it wasn't tough either, I don't know, I'll review, I'll review both of them down below. If you want to watch more Jeopardy J6, Jeopardy, Jeopardy J6 throughout the week, Teen Jeopardy and Sports Jeopardy on the weekends, then boom, subscribe. And uh, here's a Sports Jeopardy video. I did slightly better than I did in the Teen Jeopardy video, going 11 out of 12, which is pretty good for Sports Jeopardy, considering last week in Sports Jeopardy, I got like 7, I think, something like that. But yeah, uh, thank you for watching.